These are my new drum liners, and this is for a 55 gallon drum. And I got these because of the price. I thought it'd be great. Now, I don't have it on a 55 gallon drum. I'll show you in a second what I have them on. Uh, but I think these are really great bags. Uh, we use them for crawfish, and I actually uh, did two bags. So I put one in the other, and I didn't have any tears. So I thought that was really good. But I, it is deceiving because, let me open it up right here. Or I'll show you on the actual uh, can. So I have it on a 32 gallon. Uh, this is a 32 gallon um, Rubbermaid can. And you can see it almost doubles the can. So it, it's a little too big for this, uh, but I wanted some bigger ones so that I could put um, trees, sorry, not trees, leaves and stuff in them as well as use it for in the trash. But you can see how thick it is. And if I push through, it's actually holding up really well. So I really like these bags and uh, I didn't, I thought I was going to have a problem with them because they do feel super thin, but as you can see, they actually hold really well. And uh, I mean, it says tear resistant, but I don't know if I'd put some really heavy limbs in it. Um, you know, I put some short limbs, but it's going to be made uh, mainly used for trash and for leaves and debris from my yard.